Okay, here we are in front of a little larger corn now. This is probably in the V12 to V13 range. Uh, again, had some hail damage on it or simulated hail damage on it. What you're going to see first here, of course, is some leaf damage. There's uh, broken leaves, broken leaf stems, uh, midribs, etc., and leaf loss. Um, it may appear just to be cosmetic at this point, nothing too serious, but you need to start thinking deeper into the plant as to what's happening at this point as well. There could be some stalk bruising, which could lead to some loss of integrity of the stalk later, and it could lodge over, perhaps, or fall over. We also have reproductive structures that are developing also as we move up the plant. The tassel is somewhere down here, uh, a few inches down below the, the apex of the plant here at this point. A bruise in there could damage part of the tassel as well. We could damage the node at which the, the primary ear is going to develop. Um, so all those things come into play here as we look at this and as it further develops. And, and again, just take some time to see what's going to happen as this plant begins to mature. Corn here, as we looked at about a week ago, was about V12 to V13. It's progressed now to about a V17, 17 collared leaves. You see some tassels emerging, uh, but they're not fully extended yet. I would not call this VT. However, if you do look down the road at a few plants, I'll point one out here at the very end here, you do see some silks emerging, which by definition would score that plant at an R1. But again, uh, to score the field at R1, 50% of the plants would need to be silks emerging, and we're not there yet. So we'll call this still about a V17. A lot of leaf damage here, uh, midrib breakage, defoliation, etc. you can see. Uh, again, that will factor into the adjustment as to, you know, potential yield loss uh, and how that's scored. The one thing that I do want to point out here is this plant right here. Now, when this was hailed, the tassels were down still inside the whorl and not, not emerged yet. But the damage to the upper portion of this plant here has caused a tie up of the tassel. And so it's having a real difficult time trying to emerge. Now a single plant like this, uh, not a big concern. There's plenty of pollen floating around here that the ear on this plant would probably get pollinated just as uh, successfully as, any, as if it was pollen coming from the own plant. But if you had an entire field of this, Big concern, perhaps, that there might be a pollination issue uh, stemming from these tied-up tassels like this.